Today we're going to show you the pin and port view in Artmel Studio, which you can see here. And in the bottom half, you can see the red dot on P27, which is showing that the pin is high. And please do like and subscribe and check out our other videos if you like this one. So first we'll need to have a simple sketch and we're going to change the state of the IO pin in our sketch and we'll need to build and upload this to our board using the debug settings as shown in the video appearing in the top right. And then if we attach to our target we can now add some breakpoints and we can see that in our IO window that we've got our pin state showing up here as P27 and that's the built-in LED on the Arduino Duo in this case and if we step through the code where the pin state changes that's reflected in the window you can also double click on the value and actually change the state of the pin live while you're in a breakpoint so this can be very useful if you need to change the state of your IO on the fly and to get any other pins that will be available in the output registers and to get to this window just go debug windows and the IO window in Atmel Studio and you'll have all of these options for all of the hardware level items now you may be looking for a port A, B or C on your board it depends how the IO works but because we're on the DUA we have the parallel input output controller registers and there we go so it's as simple as that